Hi, Anthony Dillon here and today I want to talk about 26th of January, Australia Day because it's that time of the year again when we're coming up to Australia Day and we're looking forward to a day off, spend time with friends and family, have a barbecue, share in music, food, drink, all the great sort of Aussie stuff. So it's a great time of the year, but unfortunately we also know from past experience, not only do we have those good things happening, but we also have a lot of controversy and opposition to Australia Day. We have protesters out there protesting against Australia Day celebrations on the grounds that they think it's offensive or disrespectful to Aboriginal people. Now look, I'm not opposed to protesting in general. I think if you have a, an issue that you want to protest, protest about, great, do it. But be sure about what you're protesting about. Are the Aboriginal people today really suffering because Australia Day is being celebrated on the 26th of January? I don't think so. There are Aboriginal people in this country who are suffering, but they're not suffering from Australia Day celebrations. There are Aboriginal people, mostly in remote communities, who are suffering from sickness, poor health, uh, violence, uh, unclean, filthy living conditions. They miss out on a lot of the things we take for granted. And yet we have these protesters, mostly in the cities, protesting against Australia Day. And I think that's the real issue. That is not the real issue. That's the real distraction.